families welcome back i hope you are well i hope your day is good this video i have been dodging it for some time now maybe a week or a few days i don't know why i keep forgetting it it's about artificial intelligence in west africa a company has launched it um, i think on the 10th of this month that's august 2025 and it's about to help companies to do their jobs properly. I said, what? West Africa, this is Africans' own, according to the news. Please listen. I can't explain it more. I'll be back. Thank you for your time. This August 20th marks a turning point in the technological landscape of West Africa. The Berval Corporate Group is officially launching Ayobi, a new company specializing in artificial intelligence for businesses, but not just any company. Ayobi is what is known as a deep tech company, meaning an organization that develops cutting-edge technologies derived from scientific research, vision, innovation, and continental ambition. To discuss this, we are joined tonight by its first manager, Mr. Bawet Ensam Nikema. Good evening and welcome to BF1. Good evening. Thank you for having me. So, Mr. Nikema, Ayobi is being presented as a first in the West African sub-region. Can you tell us exactly what it is about? Ayobi is the first West African deep tech company dedicated to artificial intelligence applied to businesses. Specifically, we support companies and local leaders in their transition to AI. So whether companies want to become AI driven, meaning everything is centered around AI, or they simply want to optimize a few operational processes, Ayobi is the place to turn to. So your slogan, and I quote, the invisible is our playground. So tell us, what do you mean by the invisible? And specifically, why should companies trust you? What I always say is, AI for operations, humans for value creation. If you look at a typical day for a bank CEO today, or an industry leader, their day is disrupted by invisible operational tasks. What I call invisible operational tasks are those that are either repetitive or involve reporting, but in any case, they bring little to no added value to companies. IOB's very core purpose is to effectively eliminate those often invisible operational tasks in order to genuinely give our leaders back the valuable time to create real and substantial value, making them significantly more productive, considerably more effective, and ultimately more efficient. So, as you mentioned, artificial intelligence in business means, you know, empowerment, time savings, and better decision making. Give us some simple and clear examples to support what you've just said. Indeed, there are many examples we could mention. For instance, automated reporting management systems. There's also comprehensive behavioral intelligence, understanding precisely how the consumer behaves and how we can effectively use advanced AI technologies to optimize operational processes automatically and seamlessly. This means no longer having to deal with mundane, repetitive operational questions so that the essential tasks we perform are truly those unique and complex ones that only human beings can genuinely do. IOB is integrated into the Burval Corporate and BBS holding ecosystem. So how does this affiliation actually strengthen this new arrival? It's important to remember that BBS Holding is the leading private security group in Africa. We are present in eight countries, across three different economic and monetary zones, and we employ more than 12,000 people. The strength of this ecosystem is that IOBI benefits from cutting-edge multidisciplinary expertise in various fields, whether in banking, where we are most recognized, but also in industry, large-scale retail, and hospitality. This ecosystem allows us and allows IOBI to develop tailor-made solutions with any subsidiary of the group in order to best support our clients in their transition. In fact, what you need to remember is that we are not an isolated startup. We are the innovation of a group, a pan-African group, a leader in its field, and one that fully intends to help local leaders become global leaders. So in a context of asserted sovereignty, in a context where Africa must rely on its own assets, on its own strengths, why is it essential for Africa in any case to develop its own technologies? It's absolutely essential because in today's dynamic business landscape, many local businesses either do not utilize artificial intelligence at all, or they are currently using AI systems that were developed on other continents, which in many cases does not necessarily meet their very specific and unique operational needs and requirements. As a deep tech company with a strong and dedicated research focus, IOBI has the unique ability to develop highly tailor-made solutions in close collaboration with our valued clients. We co-create solutions that are truly adapted to our local context and our local challenges. Last question. 
All these questions related to artificial intelligence in the workplace sometimes raise concerns. Should we be worried? In my opinion, we shouldn't be afraid of AI. What jobs? Jobs. As I said, AI is for operations. Humans are for creating value. What we need to remember is value creation. The more companies create value, the more people they employ. This means we will optimize companies, making them more efficient and more competitive in the global market so that they can employ more people in their respective fields. More dynamism. Thank you very much to Mr. Nikima for joining us on our set. Thank you so much, families, for listening and watching. The way he explained it, I cannot explain it. Artificial intelligence is taking over in every corner of the world, whether we like it or not is taking over and so it's good that africa is also getting involved to to know what they are doing because otherwise a data sharing that's a privacy issue and also a lot of things that is going on in africa now we know that is from other countries that knows the best of this artificial intelligence and more and so it's good for us to get involved those who are intelligent. So it is great to know that it is from Africa and it's, it's going to be used in Africa to protect and also to help our businesses thrive. So if you are a businessman or woman or a company, I'm sure if you contact them, you heard the name already. Contact them if there's anything you are doing and you think they can be helpful to you, contact them because that's where we are going now. Whether we like it or not, artificial intelligence has taken over. I'm the one struggling with it before, but here I am using it. So, yes, if it will help your business grow and it's made in Africa or it's based in Africa, please do that. Maybe it will help your company. So, yes, this is all I want to share with you. I think it will excite the business people more than any other person. Thank you for listening and watching. Share it if possible, families, or like it before you go. God bless you all. My VIPs, my kings and queens, my returning families, thank you so much. God bless you all. Credit to BF1 for sharing this with us. Thank you. I will see you soon, families. Bye-bye.